This car lights up with something called Lumalore. It's not LED light, but paint. And not just glow-in-the-dark paint, but a special kind of paint that turns on and off by reacting to an electric charge. But how can a spray paint work like this? And how was it created? Andy Zinko had over 20 years of aftermarket painting experience, creating custom designs for all types of vehicles. In 2009, a friend asked Andy to complete a special paint job on a motorcycle, a job that would cause the motorcycle to glow in the dark. Andy was unsatisfied with the finished product. It had too short of a life and lacked a mechanism to control the glow. Andy was curious and experimental, unsatisfied with the norm. A self-described lab rat, he quickly got to work. A year later, Andy had a functional prototype, which he used to paint the album cover of Pink Floyd's Dark Side of the Moon on a Kawasaki Police 1000. This product would inspire a whole team of people dedicated to making beautiful designs glow. Darkside Scientific Incorporated patented a product they call Lumilor. It's a spray-on product that illuminates when you apply an electrical current to it. It's not like glow-in-the-dark paint. It can be applied to any surface in any variety of shapes and looks and acts just like regular paint when not charged. This Lexus painted with Lumilor, for example, looks like it came out of the factory. That is, until you turn the Lumilor on. Electric currents excite the material. Meaning you can get modulating, pulsating light effects like this. Darkside Scientific intends Lumilore to be used across the world, in aftermarket shops that, once trained, receive the designation of Lumilore Laboratories. What would you paint using Lumilore?